Hello. Hello, people. So I'm, I'm going to be doing all the rest of the stuff to make this mask good. So now I'm going to be gluing on the nose. Just like this right here. It's kind of smooth, but now it's hard. So I'm going to be gluing it on. Here, let me get on. Let me get on some music. go. The nose has been glued on. I think, think y'all were waiting for all night. Or, like, whatever time it is where you are. I got that glued on. It's nice and hard now. Okay, now I'm gonna do the straps. So I have this like mannequin head, and I'm gonna glue straps onto it. Of course, I'm gonna measure it on my head too, cause it's customized to my head and stuff. Where did my scissors go? Actually, there they are. I got a different pair of scissors today. I don't know where my other ones went. That's about good. Let me just measure this normally. It's like that much right there. So I got the elastic and I'm gonna glue it onto the mask. Got straps on now, and then um, yes, I'm gonna try this on. No face reveals today. Okay. 
this is this is how it looks. It's amazing. But I'm gonna add like eyes and stuff. It fits really well too. Give me a minute. Regular mask is back on. Okay, now I am going to add eyes. No, paint it first, then I'm going to add eyes. See that? It's, it's good. Um, where did my paintbrush go? There it is. Here, paintbrush. And then, let me just look up, since I did not look up a picture of a wolf, so I'm going to do that right now. One of those days, stuck between yesterday and tomorrow. Everything to go, everywhere to do. Just give me a second. This will be my, um, reference. So to, like, skip that song. I don't really like that song. I'm gonna just move the camera real quick. Well, at least my computer, because I can't really stream off anything else. Hopefully that's better. Yeah, you can actually see what I'm doing now. Sorry if the music's a little quiet. I just have to have it like that because my parents are home.
I do get, have like gray yarn, so I can add like fluffies to it. Hello, welcome. I'm painting it, painting the mask. So cute. And do this, I glued like the nose onto it and straps on it too, so I can put it on. In your next vid, can you do a tutorial, please? Sure. Mm. I'm like making like the base or like felting it. Um, or just like making the entire mask. Just all of it? Okay. Yeah, I can totally do that. Thanks so much. Yeah, of course. That, vid that video like may take like a couple days to um, get out though, because I have to have like time to make it and stuff. My friend is joining. Ooh, okay. No. 
nobody Ooh, nobody, 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 nobody Thanks for so much, so much for the tutorial, by the way. Yeah, of course. It was my pleasure. Hi, hello, hello, Malt Creations. I think that's how you pronounce your name. Thanks for tuning in. I'm just painting it gray right now, just as like a base coat, I guess. Cause I'm going off of a like wolf. I don't think exactly the nose is best suited for the wolf, but I'll make do with it. done with painting the base color i wish i had an airbrush that would just make this like so much easier and so and like a much cleaner look i guess but they're like 30 bucks a piece so but i would get an airbrush anyway if i could How many masks do you have? Oh, it looks fabulous. So fun. Yes. Um, I would have to actually count how masks, how many masks I have, because I have a lot. So I'll be right back. It's a heavy weight for only two feet But you don't have yourself got better I have like six, but I did give a couple to friends and like one blew off a cliff, so um I did have like eight. I would have eight if all that didn't happen, but right now I have six. I have seven including this one. Sadness is never Wait, it blew off a cliff. Yeah, I let my friend, I, I was like hiking and I let my friend borrow it. And she sat on like a really tall rock and it was like really, really windy. So it was on like the forehead, head, if you can imagine that. And um, it was really windy, so it blew off the cliff. It was pretty disappointing, but. Okay. Now I got the I got the base coat of gray done. Spins off my paintbrush. Okay. 
gonna look put like the accents of like yellow and stuff. And then I'm gonna paint the nose. Super cute things. I've been working pretty hard on it for the last two days actually. Black now. That's maybe. I love everybody because I love you. When you stood up, walked away, and the grass where you lay left a bed in your shape. Dropped it. <laughs> I love everybody because I love you. I don't need the city and I don't need the food. All I need, darling, is a life in your shape. I picture it soft and I ache. Look at you, strawberry blonde. How is the music volume? Is it like good? Or do I need to turn it up or down? Yeah, that's good. Okay, that's that's good. Just making sure. I was planning a mask night every day er, yesterday, and my I dropped my paint and it went everywhere. Oh no, that's not good. Do you were you able to like clean it up and stuff? I'm going to paint a mask now while watching this lol. It's fine, I cleaned it up. Okay, that's good. I'm glad you were man, able to clean it up and stuff. Cause that would have been bad if, it, if you didn't. Now I got all the like accent colors and stuff on. Um, I'm going to add the eyes. So I'm gonna grab the eye mesh since I didn't grab it before streaming and stuff. I'm using my fabric one today. What are you going for us for Halloween? I'm going as a pumpkin person, like a jack o' lantern person. I have it right here, the pumpkin head. I made it. Where did you get your mesh for? I'm have because I'm having a hard time. Um, this is basically just like cross stitch mesh. You can get it off Amazon and stuff. Yeah, you can get it off Amazon, as long as you, or like at a craft store. (laughs) 
but I think the optimal optimal eye mesh is probably buckram, even though I can't I'm not I've not been able to find any good quality buckram like anywhere, so I'm using a paint pen for the eye mesh to like color it and stuff. What paint type do you recommend for mesh? Um, I recommend like either acrylic or paint markers if you have them. I do not like recommend like watercolor or anything like that or oil. I have both of those. Okay. That's what I got so far. Making um it green eyes. Very much so. E is such a mood. That's what I got, and I'm gonna I'm gonna let this dry while I make the other one. How do you find out? No. How do you find out if you were a Therian? Um, I watched. I watched like I did like a bunch of research about it 
and um, I just like basically just dug deep into like all my thoughts and stuff. I do really recommend um, my theory and territory has a has a couple of videos about it, and I do highly recommend and watching those if you're questioning if you're a Therian. But like, please do proper research before determining if you're a Therian or not. Because there are a lot of misconceptions about Therians and Alter Humans. OMG, I love that YouTuber. Yes, I know. So, there's they make such great content. That was a really nice. That really helped me find out about when finding out my border called the stereotype. That's good, that's very good. And sorry if I read your message like incorrectly and stuff. I can't really see that perfectly out of my um forgot what I was gonna say. Yeah, my eyes. I can't really see that well. I know I'm a Therian. I've done a lot of research and I'm very certain I'm a Therian. That's good. Okay. And then I'm working on the other eye right now. Also, what do you think on fates? I think they're just like, they're not too particularly bad unless they're intentionally trying to be harmful, but um, I think they just need to try to get a deeper understanding of fairy and puffy and that kind of stuff and help and alter humanity. But as long as not they're not like being harmful to the community intentionally, I think they just are a bit misinformed. Not that bad. Okay. Have you told your parents, guardians, you're referring? Um, no, they just don't support that kind of stuff. That ma that mask you're wearing is cool. Oh, thanks. I made it myself. Okay, this is the second eye. And while I'm waiting for those to dry, um, I'm going to grab my yarn. Oh, and also, um, Dial Ray Ray, I think that's how you say your name. Um, welcome in. One second. 
It's Daisy, but it's okay. I'll lol. Sorry if I like pronounce your name wrong. I can't really see that well out of these. I want to tell my parents, but I don't know how. Um, I think just like explain it fully to them um, and telling them that you're one of them. Uh, Ethereum, um, fully explain what Ethereum is. Um, I think that's the best way to go about it. Yeah, I haven't told mine yet, but I'm sure there will be support. Yet. I'm just scared. Well, I did, a, I did a whole slideshow. That it's a good option. This is the mask I have so far. I'm gonna add like fluffies onto it. I showed my aunt and uncle, and they do too. Okay. That's great. I mean, last year I dropped hints, and my dad looked and started calling me too. He was saying I was joining cult, so I think I can tell my dad after a while he forgot. Okay. Well, good good luck with that. Good luck with that, though. I hope he's really supportive. Thank you. Oh, oh! I have a great eight ways of making snoots. I make how I make all my masks. Okay. I don't know how to explain though. Um, we could do do that live together thing, but I lost my streaming privilege. Lol. Oof. 
I don't know who got you stream. Um, so there's like you have to have a minimum of fifty subs. Um, and you then after that there's like this kind of like thing. Um where you know where you like press upload and stuff? You can press that, like the plus button, and plus um start streaming. But you can't stream like from like a phone until you have 1k, I think so. Yeah, I'm, b I'm bad at making cat masks, not snoots, just a cat mask. Well, with time, like in pra more practice, um, you can get better. Let me show you some of my earlier masks. That explains, ain't it, that I don't even have 30. Haha. <laughs> yeah. You can stream on phone tablets and not have 1k. Really? Uh, it, well, it didn't allow me to stream that 1k, but this is like my earlier mask. Like this right here. It's not that good. And this one too. It has like all these like little splotches and crinkles. But you get better over time. Give me a second, I'm just hanging them up. Feels like my heart is going to burst. Alone at a table for two. And I just wanna be OMG, I love them. Oh, thanks. I don't really like the way they look, but they're nice for from like not homemade masks. Also, I told you about, also the tale I told you about the last stream I wore it before my mom told me, oh, jeez. Uh, yeah, I do have, I do have tails. These, I have this one right here well, that I'm wearing, and then I have a yarn one. I have to go get it, though. I do have, like, a yarn one. But it's kind of scraggly and not that long. It's really hard to make. These look so pretty, I wish I had some. I have a big tail and my mom ordered me another one. I can't wait until I get it. Okay, that's good. I can like generally like wear tails around my house and stuff without being yelled at, but my 
older brother does not like it. I do not have any yarn and my grandma won't get it for me. Oh no. Yeah, you do need a, also a pet brush for it, but. It's not very good. Okay. And I got this like little braid thing, and I'm gonna sew, and I'm gonna sew strands of yarn into it and brush it so it's all fucking stuff. Um, I don't know where my sewing kit went though. Ah, no, it moved to my computer. Is there a specific size of yarn that you have to use for tails, or is any okay? Um, you have to, like, it would be optimal to, like, use, like, bigger, chunkier yarn. Um, but it has to have, like, these strands. Um, and you just get it. It has to, like, be able to, like, peel apart like that. So it has to be all this twisty yarn and not like the like not twisty chunky yarn. It can't be that, but I suggest like acrylic yarn too. Since I do quadro books, often my family does even bother it when I do it. Yeah. They find it normal for me to do them. Yeah, I haven't been doing quads that long. So my family doesn't really view it as like normal. But I don't really do it around the house and stuff. I do it outside. So they don't, re they don't really see me doing quads that often at least. My family find it weird, but I just do say it's homework for PE, haha. That's actually really smart. I never thought of that. Even though I do not have PE, unfortunately. So I can't do that, but. But that's really smart. I do them everywhere at wall. Okay, okay. This got some bravery. Just my, like, my brothers are pretty anti-Therian, so I, I can't really do that kind of stuff, like, in the house and stuff. And I don't want to break stuff. I'm even teaching my, my brother to do quads while he's five. Oh, okay. Sometimes I just go to the woods and do vocals. Alright. Unfortunately, I don't have that much wilderness around me. I live kind of like in a place with wilderness, but no wilderness. I do quads everywhere, not much in public, but I just saw I say someone do it in a movie and my parents are chill. Yeah, you got you guys got the smarts. Whenever I do it like outside in like my backyard or something, and my mom catches me, um, I just say it's like exercise, and I'm just trying to do like really weird exercises. 
I do quads everywhere, not. Oh, yeah, I already did that. I live in the woods. Oh, lucky. I want to live in the woods. I bark at D, deer, in my yard. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it must be kind of funny to witness. Like the deer just scattering. <laughs> That's what I got so far. I'm gluing yarn onto the side so I can put on fluffies. I chase them on all fours, <laughs> like like kind of like a. Ah, oh, I forgot what I was gonna say. Even though I live in kind of like a um, kind of like more cityed area, kind of like a mix between a s country and city, I forgot what it's called. Um, I do, I can find like forests, they're just not very bushy and well populated. Sometimes I climb a tree in my backyard. I'm re I have a red panda stereotype, and am I getting my dad to build me a tree house? Oh my gosh, that's really cool. I don't have any trees high enough or stable enough to do that. what I got so far for the fluffies. I'm gonna brush it out once I get my brush back. Yeah, it's really cool to have a territory even though my stereotype isn't very territorial. But it's still oh, great to have somewhere to call mine and go there in my free time. Well, that's really nice. I do like territory, having like a territory a lot, even though my stereotypes are also not very territorial. Okay, I think the eyes are dry now. No, they're not dry. I thought they were. Um, gee, it looks so good. Oh, thanks. Spent several, several hours on it. 
TBH, I actually have a chair to it, I just never called it that. It do be like that sometimes. Can't figure out how to use your OMG, I love of this so much. Thanks. I did make the mask from scratch, as you can see from like the cardboard here. <laughs> this might be like a longer stream because I do have a lot to work on on this mask. I have territory in my room, my room and a den made I made in the woods. I sprayed it with my perfume, but sometimes my dad comes in my room and just and because I pray spray it too much, he complains about it. Yeah. Maybe like a scent marker? Like you can make like a scent marker. It's easy. But perfume could also work really well. Damn, what's wrong with me, Dad? Yeah. I don't even allow my parents to come in my room. I'm somehow able to do that. I want to make a set marker. I don't know where to start. Yeah, that's what I mean, huh? Um, there's some. I don't. You can like put like scents that you want to like associate yourself with. Like, I associate with myself with like pine trees because I live. I live near a lot of pines. I just really like pine trees. And then you can put like spit or blood or something of yours, something that like your body produce into the scent marker. Just like that kind of stuff. That's basically like where you start. I've never actually made one, but I have watched videos on it, so. I'm just gonna skip this song. I just mixed perfume together. Okay. Oops. That's another way to make it. Hmm, I don't know what to use. I made a secret marker, but I need to redo it because it's ran out low. Unfortunately. This is how it looks so far. I need to brush up the sides. I don't know where my brush is though. I need to find it. 
I think the eyes are dry now, so I can glue them. My dad just barges in, so oh does my mom. And my mom is a bit more respectful, but my dad is less so. He does respect it, but he sometimes acts sad about it. It's not very nice of him. But bro, just... So cute. Thanks. I think I'm gonna add like fluff to the ears. Again, I just need to find my my silly brush. Just my pet brush. I don't know where it went because I don't really use it. I feel bad, but my dad died when I was six, so I never really had a full dad experience. Yeah. So sorry about that. It's not good. Very sad. Sometimes I just randomly do vocals without really knowing my mom just looking at me like, like I'm mad. When I was little, before I knew I was a Therian, I used to bark at my mom, at my mom and birds, oh well, little did I know, yeah. I've always kind of acted like a cat, just like, not know it that well. And I used to, like, pretend with my friends that... We were all animals. We, I used to do that with my friends all the time. Kind of like family, but animals. I would want to play animals with my friends. I still do. Same, same. 
a lot of my friends are Therians. So I, I do quads with them all the time. But I just need to brush like the sides out. But this is it pretty much almost finished. It's beautiful. I think I'm actually I think I'm gonna add a little bit more black. I actually got my friend into quads and it's really fun to do quads with them. That's really cool. Sometimes I play house with my little cousins and I'm always the pet. <laughs> yeah. So cute. Thanks. It's super close to being done. I just, oh wait, I almost forgot to do the ears. This, this is it so far. It is a wolf, even though I do not have a wolf stereotype, I thought it would be fun to make for 50 subs. This little special. I feel like my cousins know, but I don't know. But I'd okay. Yeah. Before I knew it was a Theron, there were so many things that I, I did that was unexplainable. Well, before I knew what Therians were, but now it makes me more sense. Oh, all makes sense. Oh well. Yeah, I can be like that sometimes. As soon as I get 50 subs, I'm gonna go live. All right. It's really fun to do quads around my house since my brother starts saying, Aww, go, go, who's doggy? <laughs> yeah, this be really fun. There we go, I just finished the ears. It's yes. Then I stared up, stand up and chase him. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna try this on. I'm gonna go off camera to try it on though. It's like, no face reveal today. How it looks on my face. I think I made it a little bit short, but it's really nice. Okay, I'm gonna put on my other mask because the paint is still wet on this. But I think I'm actually, I think I'm done with it now. It's how it looks. It's very nice. I just need to brush out the sides, but I'm pretty much done with it, so. I think this is where I'm going to end the stream today. So, goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. I'll see you whenever I go live again or in any of my videos. So, bye bye. Bye. 
Bye.